Hello students, very good morning. Welcome to Narayana Live Classes. Today, for class 7 students, we are going to discuss assignment number 65 on law exponents and powers. Okay, let us start with the first lesson. 2 power minus 1 okay, into 5 power minus 1 whole power minus 1 divided by 4 power minus 1. That is a question for us. That is otherwise. 2 power minus 1 is 1 by 2. 5 power minus 1 is 1 by 5. 4 power minus 1 divided by if I write as into 4 power minus 1 changes to be 4 power 1. Fine. Now that is otherwise 1 by 2 into 1 by 5 that is nothing but 1 by 10. 1 by 10 to the power of minus 1 that is nothing but 10 into 4. 10 fours are 40. Fine. So the value for this given expression is 40. 40 is nothing but second option for us. Okay. Now let us see the next question. X comma y they are not 0. 2x plus y by 2 is also not 0. Then the value of 2x plus y by 2 to the power of minus 1 into 2x power minus 1 plus y by 2 to the power of minus 1. What is the value for this? That is given by, if you find out the LCM, it will be 2 is LCM. So we have 4x plus y whole power minus 1 into 2x whole power minus 1 is nothing but 1 by 2x plus y by 2 whole power minus 1. y by 2 whole power minus 1, if you reciprocate this fraction, that becomes plus 1. So it will be 2 by y. Next step, if you write, that is, see, 4x plus y by 2 whole power minus 1. Then simply you reciprocate this fraction, that becomes 2 by 4x plus y. Then the power becomes, exponent becomes positive. Into, in this case, the LCM is 2xy, and the numerator part we have y plus 2x, 2s are 4x. Now, 4x plus y, 4x plus y cancels, and 2, tag, two cancels here, one time, and of course, one time, one time. So we have the answer as 1 by xy. 1 by xy is nothing but xy to the power of minus 1. 1 by xy we can write as xy to the power of minus 1. Out of the given options, fourth option is right answer for us. Okay, let us see the next question. 1 by 1 by x power minus b whole power minus 1, whole power minus 1, again whole power minus 1 is equal to x power minus a 4 power minus 1 then he is asking something very interesting question let us take the given first of all here 1 by 1 by x power minus b whole power minus 1 again whole power minus 1 again whole power minus 1 is given as x power minus a whole power minus 1 that is given Little careful we must be because a lot of power minus ones we have. If you look at this, see 1 by 1 by x power minus b actually speaking it becomes x power b. 1 by x power minus b, if you take this numerator question, it becomes x power b. But x power b again you have power minus 1. So it is x power minus b. That is 1 by x power minus b. Whole power minus 1. Whole power minus 1. That is x power minus a into minus 1. So, if you apply a power m whole power n form, that is a power mn, so minus a one times of minus 1 is plus a. This is simply x power a. That implies here, 1 by x power minus b, in fact, it is x power b. x power b whole power minus 1. So, it is x power minus b. x power minus b whole power minus 1. That is x power a. So that results in x power minus b one times of minus 1 is x power b. x power b is x power a. That implies x power b is x power a. Or we can say a is equal to b. a is equal to b. So a and b are same. Now if you look at the given, in this case, we have x power a power n minus b power n into x power a power n into x power minus b power n by x power b power n into x power minus a power n. Let us simplify this first. Then we add up for the resultant with right. That is equal to a power n minus b power n. A and b are same. So a power n minus b power n are same. 
this becomes x power 0 into here x power a power n and x power minus b power n. If you take the single base that becomes a power n minus b power n that is also 0 by here x power n same base if you take b power n minus a power n that is also 0. So x power 0 into x power 0 by x power 0 is nothing but 1 into 1 by 1 that results in 1. So this power value is 1 plus x power a plus b into a minus b that is nothing but x power a square minus b square a square minus b square as a is equal to b a square minus b square is also 0 x power 0 is again 1 plus minus here x power a by x power b x power a and x power b both are numerical this both are same values so the result is 1 so here this is going to be 1 plus 1 minus 1 that is 1 so the answer for this question is 1 1 is nothing but second option for us okay little care we have to take because lot of power minus 1 are involved here right so the final answer is 1 now let us see the next question x plus y whole power x into x minus y whole power y by here we have x power minus 1 that is 1 by x y power minus 1 that is 1 by y whole power x into here also 1 by y minus 1 by x whole power y that is otherwise here we can say x plus y whole power x into x minus y whole power y by here if you take the same this will be y plus x by x y so let me write it as x y plus x whole power x by x y whole power x into here also we have x minus y whole power y by x y whole power y that is otherwise here uh, this is otherwise these two will cancel these two will cancel this fraction this goes up and this also goes up so we have xy whole power x into xy whole power y both bases are xy only so we have xy power x plus y xy power x plus y is the final answer so xy power x plus y out of the given four options first option is x y power x plus y so that is the right answer okay so that is the end of this assignment thank you have a great day